was extremely dangerous. Uh, I will never work with Maturin ever again. Now let's get back to the Shadow One. Hello, this is the Eye of the Swarm, and today we're going to have a look at Urak, the Hunter, or the Dark Hunter in my series, and I really don't know much about him. I haven't really looked into much Bionicle lore, but I think he's pretty cool, and he's one of the few new villains that will show up, though not as a major antagonist. Anyway, I find... He cool that has articulated claws or toes, but besides that, he has some pretty complex feet. Damn it. He has a thick balls here, some thicker parts here, and of course he has his standard weapon, which will, when we get to using it, I'll show you why it's not that good. And he's supposed to have some two spikes here, but, well, they're gone. If you want to see what he's supposed to look like, have a look at this picture right over here. But anyway, he has a weird looking mask, almost broken and feral like. And the antlers aren't helping that opinion. He also has a blade which he can swap out for his gun and extra ammo. Which, speaking of which, let's have a look at his shooting skills. <laughs> Okay, we got our Vizorak and light him up, Umarak. That did not do anything. I'm st still questioning the functionality of this weapon. Maybe I'll give it some extra fi flourishes in the future. But anyway, yeah. Here's how big he is compared to a Vizorak. A Matoran, a Roxy, which is a much better hunter than he ever was, even if they didn't get the mask, and Kalamar. So you know what to do, like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see some regular content, that being dinosaurs, in the future. After all, these reviews show a hint. <laughs> oh yeah, and I managed to find something else. Umarak also comes with a mask of control. So much for keeping away from him. This mask has the ability to, well, control stuff. Honestly, I don't really know what it does, but it looks cool. And I like the little markings, kind of wish it was more than just gold, but hey, it's cool, and that's pretty much it. And I will fix up Umarak and other figures in the future.